Armitage is a graphical tool for me to exploit. It's a very effective tool, and for my, myself, I use it all the time. Very powerful, and whatever you need to do in Metasploit can be done in Armitage. But the problem is Armitage, if you start using it from Kali Linux, by default, the version installed in, on Kali Linux are not working good. So next lecture, I'm going to show you how to fix Armitage. Actually, we're going to remove it and install a new one from Armitage website. And we're going to make sure that it's working fine and we'll be able to use it. So let me show you how uh, Armitage should start first and let me show you the problem and then let me show you how to fix it. So we need to do two different comments before starting Armitage. The first one is to, is to start this specific service. It's a SQL service. And the second one is to start MSFDB and it will give you a message that the msfdb is already configured i mean if you do that for the first time it will configure it but since i did it before it gave me this message and then i can start armitage by typing armitage or by clicking the armitage icon here but you'll notice that once you start armitage it will start or it will try to start the application but it will not so it will take time like maybe five or ten minutes but eventually he will not be able to start the application so you got this connect windows you click on connect and then <clears throat> It will start with the progress here, but he will keep going till the end at, and it will not start. So what we're going to do next lecture, we're going to fix that because, you know, you'll be using that a lot while you are doing penetration testing. So you need to have a proper version of Armitage. So the best way for doing that is to remove the Armitage on, from Kali Linux and install a fresh new one from Armitage website. So I'm going to stop that. And uh, let me show you on the next lecture how to install Kali Linux uh, from their website.